Now, there's very few of them, and we really don't know why. You've certainly never seen it, probably never even heard of it. It's the Eastern Spotted Skunk. 60 years ago, there were hundreds of thousands of these skunks. Now, photographs might be the only way we know they're alive. You ready, Gracie? But to tell the story of how this picture developed, we need to do some hiking. There's several birds down here today. If it were up to him, this is where you'd find Ben Schrader. Out here in the woods on Clater Nature Center in Bedford County, Schrader shows us his passion. I became obsessed with it. Motion sensor photography. Five cameras are here at the center. Now we can remove the card and see what we've gotten. Another half dozen on Tinker Mountain in Botetourt County. Raccoon, a deer, two deer. Each time an animal passes, it gets a close up. I got interested in it when I saw in the paper that Smithsonian needed volunteers to do a predator survey with cameras along the Appalachian Trail. That was four years ago. Now Schrader does it alone. Most of the time, sometimes I'll have a partner. Schrader has taken scores of pictures over the four years he's been a part of this, but there still are some animals he has yet to capture because really he has hundreds of acres he has to cover. We know there's beaver here, but I do not have a really good clear picture of a beaver. We know from neighbors that otters are here. And then there was that skunk the payoff for what can be a painstaking process. I guess uh, the, the spotted skunk uh, definitely invoked a smile that day. In Bedford County, Chris Hurst, News 7.